this is the underwater world exhibit which was at uh, Wonderland and what you can see is there's a lot of fake coral here and then you get the impression that we're under the ocean because of all these lovely seaweeds that you can see. This part we're looking at now is uh, the ghost house and it's a bit of a spooky castle and you can see we've got a big black devil on the wall. The effect is quite nice, we've got these nice gates coming through and then as we go in there is a Dracula's table or something. Here are the duck boats that I was telling you about. Another duck boat. There's a duck boat that's uh, lost its head. I think that just before we're going to look at the Ferris wheel, let's see if we can uh, get into this planetarium exhibit. Well, this is the planetarium, and this is quite common in Chinese theme parks is that you'll have a big planetarium like this for showing uh, IMAX movies and things like that but I think they've gone a bit out of fashion now and also if you look out of the door you can see we've got a fantastic view of the ferris wheel itself well we've got to the ferris wheel and I don't know if you can hear that but you can hear it slowly creaking in the wind and if we look it's actually turning around in the wind I wonder how long it would take for one of those carts to get round the whole thing. Maybe we should jump in and find out. I've just managed to uh, get the door open and we're going through now to uh, the big wheel itself. You can see uh, the cars are all still in pretty good condition. I'm not sure I want to go in one of those cars though. But I think what we could do is go away up one of these ladders and see what like the view is like from the top. This is what we're going to try and be climbing now. I don't normally like high places, but it's actually quite, feels quite safe. Not super safe, but quite safe. I don't know if you can see this, but the, the Ferris wheel is actually moving and as it moves, it's creaking and squeaking and uh, making everything vibrate. It's actually a little bit of an uncomfortable feeling. It's much easier to see it uh, from this side, the way that it's uh, moving. It's actually going quite fast. Uh, if the wind kept up like that, I guess it would take 20 minutes to get around maybe. Here's a little bit of information about the big wheel. The big wheel, 62 meters in height, is a great thing. The great wheel has 46 small bins of different colors hanging from it. It uses tire friction driving device and turns stably and slowly, 15 minutes per circle. The passengers can get on or off at any time to look into the beautiful scenes far away. Coming out into the eating area now, and this is where all the restaurants would have been. And you can see it's actually pretty big place. I'm actually getting pretty hungry now so maybe it's time to go and find some real food to eat. It's time to say goodbye to uh, the Wonderland Great Wheel now. 64 meters of uh, fun and uh, we'll come back another day. Thank you.